Mr. Hawkseed. Yes, Frank. My goodness, what brings you to the top of the island? Ah, oh, dear, that's right. You must be in deep this time, Frank. Johnny, I need a place to stay until I clear my name. What are you saying? You're innocent? Yeah. Then, Frank, I will help you. Mr. Jonathan Hawkseed, the highest reigning crime boss in Skellery. The one man that everyone answers to in the end. Even the mayor holds a partnership with Hawkseed. Or so the rumors tell. His past has dubbed him the Expectorator. I've nearly caught him once or twice, but stayed on his good side long enough to be friends. I suspect that this avocado, what'd you say his name was, Guaco? I suspect that he is part of the group I've been trying to keep track of. A group of avocados? Avocados don't support institutions. How could they be organized? Oh, Frank, you don't know the half of it. Avocados are growing more and more common these days. They rule the flats completely. I'm losing my hold on them, Frank. I can't stand them. I'm fearing an overtaking. I may have to break my truce with Pina. Johnny, that would change everything. Yes, it would. And you can stop them, Frank. You may be on the run, but you still believe in your police work, don't you? Johnny, I don't like avocados, and they don't like me. But Frank, you're a burrito. If anyone has a chance of befriending them, it would be you. You're the one burrito with the most authority in this town. You can sympathize with them, and when the time is right, expose them for the murder and clear your own name. It's risky, Johnny. Too risky for my taste. What other course of action do you have, Frank? He was right. What else was there for me to do? So I went to Adam to squeeze him one last time. Okay, okay. I, I told you, Frank. I, I, I don't know. You know everything, Jack. You lie to me again. I'm going to put this one in your core. But, but Frank, if I know, I'll tell you. You know that. I, I gave you his name. What more do you want? It's not enough, Adam. I'm going to blow you off the counter if you don't tell me. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you, man. I'll, I'll tell you. Okay, okay. You, you, you know that cupboard? You know, the one where we got the other day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Frank, everybody knows it's on the other side of the island. That, that's where they hang out. That, that, that's, that's where they're at, Frank. See? That wasn't so hard. Amigo, you need something? Name's Frank Henderson. I know who you are. You got no business here. Then you know I used to be a cop. I know what you plan to do. I want to help. I can get you guys close. And in what terms am I supposed to believe this? They were going to kill me. I don't like him any more than you do. Plus, I think there should be more of our kind up there. <laughs> our kind? You know, Burrito, you know what I thought. Let's get this show moving then. He brought me in quicker than I anticipated. I figured I would have to turn that guy into guacamole before he let me in. There had to be another agenda here. Either way, now that I was in, they kept talking about storming the station. I didn't like some of the cops I worked with, but I sure as hell didn't want to see him dead. There had to be another way. We decided that I would go in first, tell the officers that I had found the real murderer, take him outside, and they'd be ambushed. It wasn't foolproof, but it gave me the advantage I needed to keep the guys at the station from getting their caps blown off. Alright, amigo. Your turn! Hey! I found the real murderer! When my eyes fell on Jack and that damn badge, I knew I was out of luck. That damn avocado. He had been waiting for my back to be turned this whole time. He was working for Johnny and so was Jack and the rest of the force. He used me to get rid of the avocados. Damn, that whole damn thing. And now I'm supposed to give up and be blown away? Hell no.
stand down. Tommy, I know you're a good cop, but you don't understand. There's more happening here than you know. Get rid of the gun, son. I have no evidence of Johnny's quilt, Frank. Stand down. Tommy, he's a crime boss. He set this whole thing up. I can prove it, Tommy. Frank, I have warned for your arrest. This man told us that you would come to ambush us with the avocados. This man saved my life. You're doing the right thing, Tommy. This man's a criminal. Tommy, who are you gonna listen to? I was framed, Tommy. You saw the bodies at the trash bin. He set me up. They told me differently. They told me you and the avocado were working together. That you took the blame to keep him clean. That's why Mr. Hawkseed made a deal with the avocado. This man hates avocados. There's no way in hell he'd make a deal with one of them. Sorry, Frank. I'm a good cop. I can't let you go. That dirty prune. He's had his eyes on us this whole time. I've got no other choice now. Even if Tommy let me go, Jack would get us both. I've got to get rid of Johnny myself. Looks like I ain't making it out of this one alive. Tommy, you did the right thing. He was a dirty cop, not like you. He was vile and rotten. Johnny, frozen burritos take a great deal of time before they get rotten. And he was cooked prematurely. Good job, Tommy. This is Jack Prune. I have several bodies up here and there's more in the streets. Get the chief. He's gonna wanna know what happened up here.